in trouble. Checkered flag time for Ryan Hunter Ray. First time ever for the Verizon IndyCar Series to run on the Speedway's road course. Huge accident on the main straightaway. The inaugural Grand Prix of Indianapolis to Simon Pagano. Yeah. to introduce the 11 different race winners from the 2014 Verizon IndyCar Series season. Last year's champion, a two-time winner this year, Scott Dixon. Gentlemen, start your engines. He won in Houston and the inaugural Grand Prix of Indianapolis, Simon Pagano. Climb the fence again in Detroit, Elio Castro Neves. A first time winner this year, rookie Carlos Huertas. A three time winner, including the Indianapolis 500, Ryan Hunter Ray. Conway won for this team owner at Long Beach in Toronto. Welcome, Texas Motor Speedway winner, Ed Carpenter. Last night's winner, Tony Kanan. In his return to IndyCar, he won at Pocono, Juan Pablo Montoya. One in Toronto, Sebastian Bourdais! And a three-time winner this year, the 2014 Verizon IndyCar Series Champion from Team Penske, Will Power! Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage the television voice of the Verizon IndyCar Series from NBC Sports, Lee Diffie. Hi, good evening everybody. It is uh, lovely to be here, lovely to see you all, and uh, what a way we finished things off last night. Welcome to the 2014 uh, Verizon IndyCar Series Championship Celebration, and we say not only hello and welcome to all of you here in uh, Club Nokia, but we say hello and welcome to the viewers on NBCSN, your home of the Verizon IndyCar Series. Obviously, we're here to celebrate and honour a champion, and we should say, and we just saw him as well, that he is a new champion. Another round of applause for Team Penske's Will Power. And in fitting with the tradition that Ellen DeGeneres has done on her show, uh, with thanks to Will and Liz Power, everybody here tonight will leave with a koala, a didgeridoo and some Vegemite on toast. You can bypass the last part if you want. 
But uh, on a serious note, though, and uh, we would be remiss if we did not mention this, uh, Russian rookie Mikhail Loshin, we all know that horrifying crash on Friday night in practice. Uh, Mikhail, hopefully, uh, if you're watching, uh, when this goes to air, uh, everybody in the IndyCar community, your IndyCar family, is thinking about you. We know that it's going to take some time for you to heal, but that's actually the good thing, that you will actually be able to heal and come back to 100%, and we really hope to see you next year in the Verizon IndyCar Series. It's, it's definitely not a sombre note, it's just being realistic. We really need to thank all of the folks, whether it be in Italy or here in the USA at Dallara, because that DW12 chassis did exactly what it was designed to do. So thank you to everybody at Dallara. We, we also want to thank everybody, and boy was it a speedy uh, recovery, everybody at the whole Matro safety team. Thank you guys. Thank you for what you do for the series. And of course, the IndyCar medical team. And I want to share with you a, uh, just a little side note, speaking of the IndyCar medical team. When uh, Mikhail finally regained consciousness, he started yelling. I don't want to say shouting, but he started yelling in Russian. And it was the first time in his career that Dr. Terry Trammell didn't know what to do. <laughs> but obviously he took care of it after that. All right, let's get on to the celebration. And one man we are very familiar with, and he won the championship last year. Uh, he came to a very strong end this year. I know he's quite critical of his first half, but his second half of this season was incredible. It was a miraculous win at Mid-Ohio. We were all in awe of that, and then he backed it up with a win at Sonoma. There was a string of top 10 finishes to finish the season out. He finished second last night and very nearly finished second in this championship chase as well. We know him very well. He's a three-time Verizon IndyCar Series champion. Let's welcome third place this year, Scott Dixon. And joining Scott on the stage to accept the third place team's trophy is Target Chip Ganassi's managing director, Mr. Mike Hull. Come on up, Mike. Congratulations, mate. And we would like to welcome the president of competition and operations for the Verizon IndyCar Series, Mr. Derek Walker, to make that presentation. Derek, if you'd come up as well, it'll be the first of many times tonight. Come on up, Mike. And Derek to make the presentation. Here's Derek. Round of applause for Mr. Walker, please. Third place, drivers and teams. <laughs> Derek just said, you can hold it. <laughs> Congratulations, Scott. Congratulations, Mike. Come on over, Scott. You can give that to Mike if you want. <laughs> hey, um, I, I know that this happened uh, various times without interviews over the weekend, but everybody made such a big deal about the second half of your season. How do, how do you evaluate your year as a whole? Uh, I don't know. It was, it was definitely a tough one. You know, we it's it's hard when you start the season uh, so poorly. Um, but unfortunately, it's kind of been our mo. You know, we 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 finished strong, and and uh, I can probably, you know, maybe where's Mark Miles? Why did why did we finish in September? I think we needed to run to October to actually maybe <laughs> maybe have a good uh, maybe have a good shot at the championship. But uh, you know, more importantly, congrats to Team Penske and and Will. Good effort, even for an Aussie. I think that was that was not so bad. But uh, you know, impressed, man. And, and uh, it's been a long time coming. And congratulations. And obviously, Roger and everybody there. It was a hell of an effort. And uh, congratulations. Does that make you think about your first championship? I mean, what's he feeling right now? Well, yeah, mine was. I don't, I don't know. I don't think I really knew what I achieved. I was 22 or 23 at the time, and just come on with Ganassi for the first year. And, and it was, uh, you know, I was. Just a, a guy from South Auckland that didn't really know uh, what I'd achieved, but it was uh, a tremendous feeling. And and Will, you know, and, and uh, you know, has come, you know, runner up a few times, and and you know, they, they keep fighting strong and, and try to uh, to get this championship. And this year, it's come true, and and in in real style too. So it was uh, it was good to see, and I know it must feel damn good. Well, congratulations on a good year once again, Thank you. ladies and gentlemen, Scott Dixon, and we look forward to seeing Scott next year for his 14th consecutive year with Target Chip Ganassi Racing. And we have got a whole lot more coming up from the 2014 Verizon IndyCar Series Championship Celebration here at Club Nokia. Back in a moment. To truly seek greatness, decide. Greatness.